Hi, WA4MCM here from WA4MCMKits.com and today I'm going to be uh, giving you a tour of one of my new kits. It's uh, a graphical SWR watt meter, uh, model number GM102, kind of paying homage to the old Heath kit HM102 uh, watt meter from back in the 70s and early 80s. It's a uh, it's a full-featured watt meter, uh, SWR and watt meter. It has uh, two different meter faces. Uh, right now you're looking at the bar graphs, but uh, there's also a, uh, a traditional needle face. You'll also see that uh, the forward and reflected power as well as the VSWR are displayed uh, digitally with uh, large numerals there at the bottom of the screen so you can uh, always see your, uh, see your power output uh, uh, in, in digital form. Uh, it also has uh, three scales. Uh, it can go uh, 0 to 20 watts on either the forward or the reflected power. They're completely separate separate from each other. Uh, 0 to 200 watts or 0 to 2,000 watts. Uh, it uses a touch screen. Uh, I'll give it a quick demo. You can see right now where we are uh, uh, looking at 200 watts full scale for forward power. I could change this to 2 kilowatts for full power by just touching the bar and you can see it change to 2kW and touch it again and it'll go to uh, 20 watts full scale and we'll go back to 200 watts full scale and as you can see the reflected power and, and the uh, forward power are completely uh, separate from each other so I can change the scale on the reflected power by touching the bar alright so I give a little demo real quick of the bar graphs I'll transmit 100 watts you see uh, showing a full 1.0 to 1 VSWR. Now let me demonstrate uh, the peak hold capability. So the meter also comes with peak hold. Just touch the, uh, the normal, go to peak hold. And now you'll see it, uh, it, it kind of smooths out your, your peaks. And give a Quick show on single sideband. Whiskey Alpha 4, Mike, Charlie, Mike, listening, listening, testing, testing. Go back to normal. This is Whiskey Alpha 4, Mike, Charlie, Mike, listening. See how the, the meter just jumps around so much. So back to peak. Whiskey Alpha 4, Mike, Charlie, Mike, testing. So much better on peak, uh, just smooths out those, uh, those, those peaks. Another feature of the, um, of the watt meter, uh, first let me, uh, let me demonstrate the needle. So you can just go up here to the settings menu, choose needle, save it. So Whiskey Alpha 4, Mike, Charlie, Mike, listening. Another nice feature of the of this watt meter is it connects to your uh, connects to your computer so that you can uh, remotely control the meter. So what we're going to do is uh, I've got the the application that comes with it is running on my PC right next to it, and as you can see, it matches the exact uh, the screen on the uh, on the watt meter. Uh, Whiskey Alpha Four, Mike, Charlie, Mike, testing, testing. All right. So you can control all the features of the, uh, of the watt meter from your computer. I can change back to the bars, go back to the, to the bars. And you can see the uh, meter changed and then also the, uh, the application changed the meter face. So you notice that the meter changed first and then the application changed second. It's because it's a two-way communication. What I did was I sent the, uh, the command to the meter to change its meter face and then the application waited for that to happen and it gets a response back from the meter saying that it had changed so it goes, it goes ahead and changes the meter face. Uh, you can also uh, just like on the meter you can change scales by clicking in the, uh, in the bar All right. You can also change.
from peak cold to normal hold by by clicking the peak cold and normal. Whiskey Alpha 4, Mike Charlie Mike testing. Go back to peak. Uh, let's change to the needle and I can show you how to change the scales. So right now we're looking at forward power. In order to change the meter to reflected power, just click anywhere in the reflected power um, uh, frame down here. And you'll see it changes the reflected power. To change the scale, just click anywhere in the, on the meter except for uh, where the peak cold is. Just click anywhere and you'll see that it changes the scale. So we go back to forward power. You can see we change there just by clicking anywhere in the scale. And then one last thing to demonstrate is on the settings, you choose the COM port. Um, right now the uh, the meter is uh, assigned to COM 13. Now that will vary, of course, depending on on your uh, on your particular meter and also on your particular PC. But uh, right now it's on COM 13, so you just choose the COM port and then save it and then. Um, uh, you're off to the races. So, I hope you enjoy this quick tour of the uh, SWR watt meter. It's going on sale here for very soon. In fact, I'll be at the uh, at the uh, Winterfest in Vienna, Virginia on the 19th of March, and that's where it's going to debut. Thank you very much.